Yeah, I mean, it's a good day. Yeah, everybody. I'm from Fairfield, Vermont, and I work for the Howard Center here in Burlington in Chittenden County, and I'm a member of AFSME uh, as my union, and um, I am here because of Scott Walker coming to town and, and Phil Scott meeting with him. Uh, he says it's out of respect for Phil Scott that the Republicans invited. He didn't. And I say, well, how about respecting Vermont workers rather than an out-of-state um, uh, demagogue. I don't know if he's is quite the demagogue, but he's certainly a union-busting politician who um, seems to be making the rounds, and I am um, I say, no, thank you. Go back where you came from. So uh, my name is Troy Dassler. I'm a former teacher. I was a teacher in Madison, Wisconsin when Walker brought his horrible ideas to our state. And I just feel just so upset that, the, that it's spreading even to this beautiful state of Vermont. And um, I saw what he did there and it was pretty horrible. And I hope that every person in Vermont realizes what he did and comes out and says, this is not good for our country. This is not good for our schools and it's not good for our our nation so I'm really glad to see and so when I heard there was a, a protest here in Vermont I'm like well that's my nature I'm used to uh, having to protest this man because the man is full of full of really really a lot of ideas most of them are bad so I'm really happy to be here in solidarity with my brothers and sisters here in Vermont thank you Scott. Scott's is. Might as well link them together, right? They are a party. And they're at a party right now. When it comes down to it, there's a lot of things that I've kind of read and got to know about Scott Walker is that he says a lot of things and at the end of it he says great mistakes. The great mistake is that he came to Vermont today. He came here to try to deny unite bargaining. Trying to unionize freight or free or fair labor practices amongst other union members to organize. Scott Walker has also done a lot of other great mistakes in his time. Not being able to let same marriages, he's called that a great mistake. Sorry. A lot of great mistakes that Scott Walker has made is calling things great mistakes. Sorry about that. Um, same-sex marriages, he called that a great mistake. Allowing abortions for women and having the right to make their own decisions of their own body, whether it had been rape, incest, after 20 weeks he put it into state law that they could not make this choice after 20 weeks. He's actually asked that Immigrants are not allowed to have amnesty in certain states or cities or townships, which is another grave mistake. The one thing I have to say about Scott Walker, and I hope you don't take this the wrong way, that hopefully he's going to be walkering his ass out of this city today. We go down and we kick it in front of his gracious dinner that he's going to have today. With fellow ado, I had to invite my friend up here and spearhead guy, whose brainchild this whole entire organization Stop. is David Van Dusen, vice hey, president hey, of the CIO.
right, so let's get lined up and let's march down. <laughs> City Hall, right here in Burlington, Vermont. We don't like this guy being here. He isn't invited by us. He's invited by the Alternate Facts Coalition. Thank you. Wisconsin from K through college. Bad news. Oh, can you write anything about us? Do you have a, 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 a command? 
I'm from Rights and Democracy. My name is James Haslam. I live in Essex, and I'm out here to stand in solidarity with people in Vermont and all across the country that are standing up against this right-wing agenda that is trying anti-worker uh, and is, is really being funded by a handful of radical billionaires uh, <clears throat> to, to hijack our country. They're not going to take it, but they're just not going to take it. So. I'm an, I'm an American patriot. I'm trying to fix it in our land right now. If we don't fix it in our land, it's going to be fixed somewhere else. Take that. Uh, I'm not actually part of a union. I'm just a local activist who wanted to get involved, and I heard that Scott Walker was coming, and I was incensed. And so I decided to join all the unions that came here in solidarity with workers and oppressed people everywhere. Yeah.